This is a general reading. Please contact me to schedule a personalized reading specifically targeted to address your situation in depth. I drew three cards for you today. They are the Ace of Cups, the High Priestess, and Strength. The Strength Major Arcana card continues to make an appearance throughout our April readings, having been drawn on both April 1st and April 2nd. In today's reading, there are two major arcana cards and their energy works together to dominate the reading. They are the High Priestess and Strength. Our April readings are repeating similar themes as the High Priestess card coincides with the Four of Swords that was present in the April 2nd reading along with Strength. The message is the same, only the varying card is the Ace of Cups. This reading speaks about the importance of getting in touch with your intuition or higher self in order to achieve your life's purpose. Yesterday's reading delivered the message to use self-control and love to position yourself for blessing. There was a heavy focus on resting and using meditation to get in touch with your higher self so that you could discover your divine purpose in life. Today's message reads along the same lines. There is a heavy emphasis on getting in touch with your intuition, letting love rule your life, and practicing self-control, temperance, and not giving in to those who would bait you and cause you to miss your destiny. Do you know how to get in touch with your intuition? Do you know how to listen to your inner voice and do you follow its guidance? Many people live their lives running on empty as they just try to make it from one day to the next. They are often so busy with the hustle and bustle of daily living that when their higher voice, their intuition speaks to them, they miss it. Some people have lived their entire lives drowning out their intuition and are clueless when it comes to following its lead. The best way to get back in touch with your intuition and to learn how to follow its guidance is through rest, reflection, introspection, and meditation. Open your heart to love. Take time to meditate and be still. Use the strength of your mind and willpower to walk in love and resist the urge or temptation to live in negativity in whatever form it presents itself. By doing these things, you will position yourself for blessing and abundance. God bless you.